The house down the street is on fire. How do you know? There is smoke coming from the house. Did you call 911? I am going to call right now. I think they're having a barbecue. This is nothing to joke about. No, I mean the smoke is coming from a grill. Oh, that explains the delicious smell. Were we invited? I'm afraid we were not. How sad, even after saving their burning house. How many roommates do you have? There are five of us in total. Wow! Don't you ever fight? Sometimes, but we try not to. Who does all the household chores? We take turns so that it's fair. That's a good way to do things. Yes, it is, and it helps us get along better. What about when one of you has a girlfriend over? We agreed to try not to have them over too often. I guess it would be a tight squeeze. Too tight for any of our liking. Who let the dog inside? I did. What's the problem? He got mud all over the new carpet. That wasn't him. I just gave him a bath. Now that I look closer, these look like footprints. Well, they're not mine. They're too big. They're not mine either. I haven't been outside. I think those are Dad's footprints. I think you're right. Dad's in big trouble now. Yes, he is. Maybe he'll sleep in the doghouse tonight. I don't think the dog wants Dad as a roommate. I made a terrible mistake. What's the problem? I made the check for the mortgage and didn't mail it. When was it due? Yesterday. I thought I sent it three days ago. It was just an honest mistake. Do you think I can send it now? Well, you have to. They may charge a late fee, though. I have to be more careful when making the payments. Yes, you do. I'd hate to be evicted. Don't joke about things like that. I'm sorry. I'll go mail the check now. I need a bigger closet. I think you just need fewer clothes. A woman can never have too many clothes. She can if they don't fit in her closet. Maybe we should take your things out of it. Then where would I put my clothes? You can put them in a small wardrobe. I think it's easier if you throw some dresses out. My dresses are nicer than your clothes. I only have the clothes that are necessary. So do I. I need to look nice more often than you do. I wish your attitude was as nice as your dresses. I have a big surprise for you. 
Is it a new toy? No, it's a big announcement. That doesn't sound very exciting. We are moving to a new house. What's wrong with our apartment? Well, a house is bigger. Apartments are cozier. You can have a dog in the new house. But we already have a cat. The new house has a tree house in the backyard. Now there's a big surprise. I'm so excited. There are holes in the wood in the garage. Are they big or little? They are actually quite tiny. That is very worrisome. Why do you say that? You could have termites or carpenter ants. You mean bugs could be eating at my house? Yes, it is a very serious problem. What should I do? You need to fumigate them immediately. Bugs are such a hassle. I wish they were all dead. I want to form a secret club. That sounds fun. Where would the club meet? Maybe we can meet in my attic. No way. It's dark up there. We just need to take flashlights. What if we fall through the ceiling? I don't think that will happen. Most attics are haunted in movies. Do you really believe in ghosts? No, but I don't want to risk it. Maybe the attic isn't such a good idea. Let's meet in the living room instead. I'm planning a housewarming party. Is that to celebrate buying a heater? Don't be so sarcastic. I really don't know what that is. It's so that we can meet our neighbors. I don't really want to meet our neighbors. Quit being so negative. What do we do at this party? Everyone brings a dish and we sit and eat and talk. Sounds like a regular party. It's a regular party. Next time, don't call it something so strange. This is the perfect house for us. It has all the bedrooms we need. Each bedroom even has a bathroom. The backyard is huge! And we finally have a pool. What's the price for this house? I didn't expect it to be so high. This house is hideous. I agree. We should look for a different house. A house like this wouldn't be so bad. As long as the price tag doesn't make it hideous. Let's check the price first next time. What is that you're riding? It's my new riding lawnmower. It looks like a sporting vehicle. 
Mowing the lawn can be a sport. That doesn't sound like a very exciting sport. It's exciting on a riding mower. How long does it take you to finish the lawn? Around 20 minutes. It takes me an hour most of the time. This tool is fun and convenient. Can I borrow it sometime? No way. A racer never lends out his race car. The pool is filthy. I forgot to put on the cover last night. There are mosquitoes buzzing around it. They lay their eggs in the stagnant water. How are we supposed to go swimming? You have to wait until I clean the pool. Can you clean it now? I have to before more mosquitoes hatch. Try not to get bitten. I'd hate to be hospitalized for a mosquito bite. If you are, make sure you finish the pool first. Your concern over me is heartwarming. There is garbage all over the ground. Those raccoons knocked over the trash cans again. I feel like calling animal control. Would they take care of the problem? I think they'd come and catch them. What would happen to the raccoons? They'd be released into the wild. What if they put them to sleep? I didn't think about that. Maybe it's better to buy chains for the trash cans. I think so too. That way we won't kill any raccoons. I am tired of living in my apartment building. Didn't you just move in a few months ago? Yes, but I really regret it. Why do you regret it so much? My neighbor is a percussionist. That sounds awesome. I love the drums. You wouldn't love them at three in the morning. He plays that late into the night? All the time. It sounds like I live in the jungle. Why don't you just complain to the landlord? I didn't want to cause problems. Your neighbor caused problems in the first place. I repainted my house, so I need some new furniture. What pieces are you looking for? A new table, a sofa, and maybe a reading chair. What's wrong with your old furniture? It doesn't match the room anymore. Is it still comfortable to use? Yes, I think I will sell it. You can also get it reupholstered. Are you crazy? That is much too expensive. It depends on where you have it done. I still say that it takes too much effort. Trying to help you takes too much effort, too. My apartment is too far from work. 
Have you considered moving? I've thought about it. Where would you move to? I don't like the neighborhood around my job. What about the next one over? Then I'd be too far from school. There are some apartments in between the two. I went to see them, but they were too small. Why don't you live in a townhouse? I suppose that would be a good idea. Of course, it's a good idea. It was my idea. Apartments are so expensive these days. Only rich people can afford to live in them. My landlord raised the rent, so I'm moving out. Where will you live? I don't know yet. I have to search for an apartment. Are you going to live alone? Well, I've never had a roommate before. I would find one if I were you. It would be helpful in paying the rent. Post an ad on Craigslist and see who replies. If a psycho becomes my roommate, I'll blame you. If that happens, I'll stay far away from your apartment. I can't unlock the door. Maybe it's because the key is brand new. The lock won't turn at all. Are you sure the key is not upside down? I've flipped it five times. It still doesn't work. No, the door is still locked. Let me try to open it. Maybe you'll have better luck. I see what the problem is. You're using your old key. Oops! I'm so used to my old house. It's all right. Eventually, you'll get used to this one. I don't like the color of the walls. It's a very bright color. I want to repaint the whole house. What color will you use? I was thinking a nice blue color. That sounds very nice and soft. Will you help me paint the house? I think we will still need help. I'll ask some others to join us. Will you pay us? I'll pay you with pizza and soda. It's a deal. I'm hired. My son broke a window yesterday. How did he do that? He said he was practicing his pitching. He was pitching against the window. No, against the side of the house. If he missed, he's not a very good pitcher. No, but he's pretty fast and can run long distances. How do you know that? I chased him when I found out he broke the window. Well, you contributed to his training. As his coach, my fee is three months of his allowance. What a coincidence! 
That's enough for a new window. Why are you cutting into the wall? I bought a new air conditioning unit. I don't think that's how you install it. Have you ever installed one before? No, but that still looks wrong. I think I know what I'm doing. I see water pipes behind that wall. I don't think that's good for the air conditioner. I don't think so either. Will you call some professionals now? I guess that's the best thing to do. You should have done so from the beginning. You have so many portraits on your wall. I love displaying all the pictures I've taken. How do you hang all the picture frames? I just hang them on the wall. You don't use nails, do you? Well, yes, I do. You're not allowed to use nails in an apartment. Why not? It ruins the walls for the next tenant. I didn't think about that. You'd better use poster putty the next time. I'll cover all these holes with paint. You sure bought a lot of Christmas lights. I want the house to be shining this Christmas. Do all of the houses on the block decorate? Yes, they do. It is quite beautiful. I can wait to see when it's done. A parade marches by every year so people can see them. What are you doing on the roof? I'm going to make it look like it snowed up here. Are you using Christmas lights and cotton? That's right. I'll install a Santa Claus, too. You sure are full of Christmas spirit. Of course. It only comes once a year. I told you not to go into my room. I was just looking for a pencil. You're always making up excuses. My explanations are not excuses. You just want to snoop around my room. I don't want to be in your smelly room. Then stop going into it. Then help me find the things I need. Fine. From now on, ask me for anything you need. You promise not to get angry with me? Only if you promise not to annoy me. Deal. Can I please have a pencil now? You were a cute child. How would you know? Your mom posted your baby pictures on Facebook. When did she do that? Last week. Didn't you see them? No, my laptop is in the shop. 
Most of our classmates have seen them. This is too embarrassing. It is not that bad. I'm going to make her delete them. I should mention there are videos too. My reputation is ruined. You should add me on Facebook. I don't have a Facebook. Why don't you make one? I don't have money. Facebook is free to join. What do I have to do? Go to the website and sign up. It says I need an email address. Don't you have one? I don't remember the password. Don't you ever email friends? I like texting better. Do you have any online accounts? What is an online account? Something you use on social networks. I don't know what those are. Websites where you talk about yourself. Why would I want to do that? So you can make friends. I already have friends. You can make more friends. But I don't need more friends. Forget I mentioned anything. You're still my friend, right? Why are you taking pictures of yourself? I need a profile picture. Just use any picture. I need it to be perfect. Have you added any new friends? I added our classmates. The girls too? A few of the girls. A good picture won't get you a girlfriend. Maybe they will think I am handsome. Why would they think that? Girls like a guy with a nice smile. Why does Facebook need my birth date? So people can know how old you are. But my friends know how old I am. People who are not your friends. I don't want them to see my age. What's wrong with it? It's better if I seem older. Why is it better? Then I will seem more mature. But you post about cartoons a lot. Adults can watch cartoons. Those adults should get a job. I saw the pictures of your date yesterday. It wasn't a date. Didn't you go to the movies? Yes, I went to the movies together. Then it was a date. The girl was my cousin. I see. That was my mistake. You should not assume things. So Facebook dating did not go well? I don't just use Facebook for dating. What else could it be for? I play games sometimes too.
The cute girl from class added me on Facebook. Has she sent you any messages? Not yet. I'm still waiting. What makes you think she will? We have a lot in common. How do you know? We posted about the same TV show. Why don't you send her a message first? I am afraid she will reject me. Just try to be friends for now. I can't message her if you're here. Fine, then I won't help you. I met someone online yesterday. Who is it? A boy from Budapest. Where is Budapest? I asked him that question too. What did he say? He said it is in Hungary. Is that very far away? Thousands of miles away. How can you be friends then? I just like talking to him. Maybe he'll teach you Hungarian. Why did you fall asleep in class today? I stayed up late playing Farmville. What is that? A game on Facebook. You play too many games. You should play with me sometime. No way! I don't want to. Why don't you? I don't want to be a zombie. What's a zombie? What you'll become if you play too many games. I guess I should play less often. Are you ready to go home? I can't go home yet. Why? Do you have club activities? No, I have detention. Why did you have detention? Because I did not turn in the homework. Weren't you homesick yesterday? Yes, I was very sick. Then the teacher should understand. He saw pictures of my party on Facebook. If you're not sick, you shouldn't stay home. I think I'll just unfriend him. I was fired from my part-time job. Why did you get fired? My boss said I was too irresponsible. Didn't you do good work for him? I missed a few days of work. Why is that a problem? I went to the arcade and he found out. Did you post pictures on Facebook again? Yes, but I didn't know he'd see them. Everyone can see your Facebook. I'll be more careful next time. Just don't do bad things at all. I'm deleting my Facebook. 
I thought that you liked Facebook. I do, but it's inconvenient. Are the games not fun anymore? That's not it. Did you get bored of reading posts? No, I still like them. Did you lose interest in your friends? Of course not. Then what's the problem? It's too easy to be stalked. Don't worry. Only attractive people are stalked. I found a new social networking site. That's cool. What's it called? It's called Tumblr. It's a blog site. It's blogging different from Facebook? It is very different and much more fun. Why is it more fun? You get to see more people's posts. What kind of posts? Many different kinds based on your interests. It sounds fun. Is it free? Yes, it's free. All right, I'll join. Just don't follow my blog. I am following my favorite artist on Tumblr. Why are you following their blogs? I'm hoping they will see my drawings. What would that do? I heard that some artists find jobs this way. You mean the artist hires them? Sometimes, if their art is good. That sounds amazing. Tumblr is very good for getting noticed. I want to be a singer. Maybe you can post some songs on Tumblr. I don't think Lady Gaga will notice me. Do you know about phone applications? Not much. Are you looking for one? I want to download the Tumblr app. If you do, you'll never do any homework. Why do you think that? You'd waste time on your phone all day. Don't you think I am responsible? I know you're not responsible. Why would you say that? Because you never turn things in on time. Maybe I'll enroll on online classes. They won't be anything like Tumblr. I'm sorry. My grandma took away my phone. What did she do that for? She said it was too late to be talking on the phone. You said you'd call me at 9 p.m. That's the time she sent me to bed. How can anyone sleep so early? She said that was her usual bedtime. I guess old people need to sleep longer. Not really. She woke me up at 5 a.m. this morning. Wow, your grandma really loves sunlight. I'm so exhausted.
Is that boy you walk home with your brother? No, he's my neighbor. Does he go to your house often? We hang out there almost every day. Your parents don't mind that? Of course not. They've known him since we were children. He might as well be your brother. I prefer having close friends to having a brother. What's wrong with having a brother? Brothers always fight over things they don't want to share. Are you afraid he'd take your things? No, I'm afraid he'd take my girlfriend. I'm tired of living with my sister. I don't like living with mine either. There should be a place to send annoying siblings. What kind of place? I don't know. Maybe the zoo. My sister is too wild to live in a zoo. I think she'd scare all the animals. Yeah, and eat all of their food. What about the aquarium? I guess the shark tank would be a good place. It's too bad that humans can't breathe underwater. What a shame. It was the perfect plan. Do you want to come to my house tomorrow? My mother says I'm not allowed to go out this week. Why are you not allowed to go out? We are having a family reunion. Your whole extended family is staying over your house? Yes, I'm looking forward to seeing my cousins. Are they fun to play with? Yes, last year we played a trick on my grandpa. What did you do? We replaced his denture glue with toothpaste. I don't think that's very funny. It was when his teeth fell into the mashed potatoes. Mother, may I go play outside? Have you cleaned your room yet? I promise I'll do it later. You said that yesterday. Go、I'm... clean it now. I really mean it this time. I'll clean it later. All right. Go play for a bit. Before I go, may I have a cookie? You can have it later. But it's the last one. Someone else might eat it. You can have it now if you go clean your room. I think I'd rather go out and play. Then I think I'll have the cookie for snack. Do you like this new dress I bought? It looks a little too big for you. I bought it for my mother. Is it for her birthday? 
No, it's a present for Mother's Day. Is it that time of year already? Yes, Mother's Day is next week. I have to hurry and find a gift for my mother. I'm sure it will be easy. I hope it won't be difficult. By the way, you never told me what you thought of the dress. It's beautiful. I am sure your mother will love it. I don't know what to give my dad for Father's Day. Why don't you give him a card? I already bought a card, but I want to give him a present too. What does your father like to do? He likes to cook. Maybe you can give him a chef's hat. Be serious. That gift is not practical. What other sorts of things does he like? He likes carpentry. What about getting him a new carving set? That sounds like a good idea. Let's look for one online. Computers are so amazing. I agree. I love the new webcams. Did you buy one recently? My laptop came with one. My mother loves it. Who does your mother use it to speak with? She calls my great aunt from out of state. I didn't know you had a great aunt. Neither did I. That webcam is bringing your family together. It really is. I cannot wait to meet her. I thought you already talked to her often. I do, but I will meet her in person next month. Son, come here, please. What is it, mother? Did you touch the frosting after I told you not to? No, I didn't touch the frosting. Then tell me, why is it all over your face? I ate some, but I didn't touch it. You should not tell lies. I am not lying. My hands did not go near the frosting. Then how did you eat it? I used a spoon, so I didn't touch it. I didn't disobey you. You knew what I meant. No dessert for you tonight. That's all right. I've already had some frosting. The girls at school don't want to be my friends. Why don't they want to be your friends? It's because I don't dress like they do. There is nothing wrong with the way you dress. They listen to different music. Music is pointless if you don't enjoy it. 
They curl their hair and eyelashes. Doing that every day damages your hair. Maybe if I do those things, I can be their friend. It won't be fun to do things you don't enjoy. Then who will be my friend? I'm your friend because I like you for who you are. Dad, why do you like fishing so much? Fishing is a good way to clear your mind. Is that because everything is so quiet? That it is exactly why. Don't you get bored just sitting and waiting? There is more to fishing than just sitting and waiting. What do you mean? To be a good fisherman, you have to read nature. The same way you read a book? Almost the same way. You'll learn in time. Is that what you like most about fishing? No, I like fishing together with you the most. We have to babysit this afternoon. Why can't we ever go out with Mom and Dad? They say they need time away from children. We're not children anymore. I guess that's why we have to watch the baby. What do you want to do first? We can play some video games. Do you want to have ice cream for dinner? That sounds good to me. Oops! I spilled chocolate on the carpet. We'll say the baby did it. Maybe babysitting isn't so bad. It's too cold to go swimming today. That's okay. We can make a sand castle. Dad forgot the buckets at home. We can explore the tide pools. Maybe we'll find some crabs. I think I'd like a seahorse better. We can put them in our aquarium. That's a great idea. How will we carry them without buckets? I forgot. We don't have any. What is there to do now? Wait until it's time to go home. Why did you throw snow at your brother? It was a snowball fight. He said he didn't know you were playing. Well, he should have known once he felt the snowball. Does this have anything to do with the snowman? You mean the one he knocked down? That's exactly the one I mean. Maybe, but I just wanted to have a snowball fight. You should be nicer to your brother. He should be nicer to my snowmen. Go say you're sorry and play nicely. Only if he says he's sorry first.
Can Spotty be in the family picture too? No, he cannot. Dogs are pets, not family. Spotty is older than I am. That still doesn't make him a human. Sometimes it seems like he can talk. I said no, so the answer is no. What if we put a hat on him? Why would you want to do that? Then he'll look just like my little brother. You're really attached to him, aren't you? Yes, he's like part of the family, too. All right, he may be in the photo, but no hat.